Greetings everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about Mars, Saturn, and the Moon in the primary matrix. Greetings. This infinite source truth is made possible by the generous contributions and support of viewers like you. Please consider making a contribution now. Thank you. In the primary matrix, Saturn is the key planet. And that is where our bodies are hooked up to experience this secondary matrix illusion. When the bodies are cloned, whether it's our biological machines to experience more lives in this secondary matrix, the cloning is done and the bodies are, were put into a cloaked moon. A body went from being a cloned petri dish size to a full giant form in nine months. No infant stage, just a rapid growth into a full biological machine. Now, when completed, they're taken back to Saturn and hooked up to the secondary matrix. And you put your source energies into them to create your life experiences. Now, when you had sex and orgasm within this secondary matrix experience, then there were what you call eggs and sperm removed from you to create, clone, a, another of you which would not have your source cell, your synergy cell, soul cage within it. Those were sent to the cloaked moon to grow out and then be returned to Saturn and placed into the secondary matrix hookup where your source energies are running everything. Now, those, I'm going to say, clones of you that have no synergy cells, no energy of you that are not your character players are like meat sacks or uh, simply biological bodies like your primary matrix bodies are that are hooked up to experience the secondary matrix. They are duplicates of you except for you are not in them. You do not have a soul cage. They do not have a soul cage or a source player empowering them within their bodies for an experience. They are dumb, blind. That's the way it is. For them to stay alive, there must be a hookup to the secondary matrix to feed source energy into them to keep them alive until the time for them to be harvested. Now, think of all of the animals that man has domesticated for their own use for meat and other products, even within the secondary matrix illusion. There is a created non-character player for these bodies and they're hooked up to get energy from the matrix to support their giving them life, if you can call it that. They have no brains, they have no minds, they have no consciousness. And even whenever stimulation to certain things are placed in their body to create a response, which you call feeling, or you might consider feeling, it is not really them being conscious, it is simply an electrical 
way of creating a response of fear or whatever into those bodies, making them more desirable for sale or use. Now, there are other planets, and specifically Mars is a large consumer of the products that are created from those bodies and from the harvested material that we had harvested off of the Earth's. Now, why are we important to them is because it's the last remaining way of obtaining the substance, the drugs, and the biological materials that creates those things that they desire that were previously harvested from the two Earths. So we, by our choices and actions within this secondary matrix, give them permission to create more clones of us that do not have our source energy cell, synergy cell, soul cage within them. And they are simply hooked up and assigned a non-character player role within this secondary matrix. Now, I'm going to stop there. And if you have a strong source cell connection, you can research that all you like, come to a knowing and a comprehension of how that works. But I think that's more than enough information regarding that aspect of the game. I went through it before when I shared about the orgasms and what the orgasm gives consent to. Now, you can no longer lose a piece of your soul or reduce your soul cage by soul cage by that action. However, you still give consent to it costing you energy and consent to no longer harvest any eggs or sperm, but it does allow them to create more clones from the cloned bodies, which are not as desirable as the ones that were actually cloned from you because they're clones of a clone. So it creates a less than desirable product, but however, it is still a product. Now, if you find the information that I've shared in these videos and the work that I've done within the matrix to be a benefit to you, then it benefits you to say thank you with a gift via PayPal. The link is in the description box below. Abundance, health, and prosperity to you.